Good morning, folks. Well, I'm going to uh, basically try to show you how to get connected to the websites you need and to make sure you can fully use the desktops you're at um, so the computers are able to uh, successfully allow you to, to run the simulation. So the instructions on the worksheet say to Google FET membrane. So here we go. And we click on the first option, it's FET, just like we want. We click here. And you can see that it is Java based. The desktops we use, the desktop computers, may or may not automatically play this. I want to show you what that looks like. I'll proceed to show you different ways that your desktop, while I'm gone, might respond when you try to get the simulation running, okay? But let's just go and assume it's all going to work out smoothly. So let's do this. So we hit play, and you can see down here it says this type of file can harm your computer. Now our school district computers uh, really have safeguards. They want to make sure you're not downloading anything that could harm us, right? Uh, or harm the computer, the, the hardware. We just click keep, and then we're not done. We have to click this arrow, and of course I'm using Google Chrome. Please use Google Chrome, it's just what we all do. Get with the program. All right, you click open. Now, check this out. I like this. This is perfect for us to see. It says, your Java version is out of date. It says, update recommended. We, when using school equipment, we can't update anything. If you have your home computer, you just hit update, everything's fine. But on school computers, you can't. And we don't want to block it. If we block it, we can't run the simulation. So luckily, there's this option right here. It says later. So boom, you click later. And let's see if it activates. So far, so good. And then last but not least, you just click Run. Now, this thing opened up in an uh, all-new window, and that's just how Java works. It doesn't pop up on the website. It's going to open up in its own window, and then you'll proceed to do what you got to do. That's one situation. That, that's probably how your download of, of the sim will go. But let's pretend it's something else. Let's pretend you get something kind of like this. Now, this is a different website, but it's a good example. You see how it says click to enable Adobe Flash Player? Flash Player is not the same as Java. Now, this simulation runs on Java, and that's the symbol for Java. But on your desktop computers uh, in the classroom at the tables, they may have something that looks like this, where it says click to enable Java. Now, in this case, it says Flash, but it could also say uh, Java. So what I want you to know is you gotta click the letter. If you click, you might be able to click the puzzle piece, it may work, but sometimes it's just the letters and I think the desktops are like that. So you just gotta click and you see what it says? Up at this little eye zone right here allows you to make that decision. Do you wanna allow this or not? If the computer shows you something like this and it's all click to enable Java, well, you just click it and click allow. And you can see this isn't the activity we're doing, it's just an example. But the basic idea is, is if it doesn't run like uh, the video is showing, you can always click this eye up here and it will give you this list of options. Of course, this is, this is what Google uh, Chrome looks like if you're using that web browser. But it allows you to, to allow Flash, Java, so even if Java was on this page, I could always allow on this site. You can make those decisions. So the desktop will allow you to do it. So you have one thing where you kick, if it's Java, it may hit play, right? Pops up down here, hit keep, et cetera. Um, if it doesn't do that, if it doesn't jump down at that bottom uh, menu option, you may see something more um, like we had on this page where you had to click to install and then up here popped up and you would have hit allow. That should work for all you need today. The other activity you'll be doing, um, this is the first part, is investigating membrane channels with the FET simulation. The second part of the day, you'll be using something that's called HTML, which is embedded in the website. So this wacky thing here, this um, from the website Bioman Bio. And you shouldn't have to download, install anything. It should just start right away when you get to the website and click the link. All right, good luck on downloading and playing The Sims.